Hello YouTube, Rain Florence here with you celebrating 37 years Earthside. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty happy about this hair growing back. I was looking back at some of my old videos. I don't like myself with short hair. So I'm glad that experimentation with short hair is over with because it's finally starting to grow back and I like it. So I'm happy to be back with you. You know, from the past, I had many years worth of breastfeeding videos, health videos deleted, erased by YouTube, but I'm back with you guys. So I wanna hear from you. What would you like to see from me? I'm pretty much the same Rain Florence. <laughs> Here peeling my bananas. I want to inspire you to get healthy, to exercise, to raise strong and healthy children. Um, I have lots of recipes, ideas. I have just so much I want to share with all of you. So anyway, I'm just appreciating this day, appreciating everything and peeling my bananas. Where are my bananas? <laughs> okay, yeah. So just spotty right bananas, just starting back with the basics, you know, when they're ripe, they're spotty and brown looking. They're not only for banana bread, they're also for your freezer. You can mix them, make a smoothie, banana ice cream. Oh my goodness. Back with the basics. The basics, this is where it all started for me, was the simple banana. Learning how to eat the banana instead of bread. Bagels, donuts, chips, cookies. Give your kids this for snacks. You know, it's, it's, it's wonderful. There's different ways to prepare the banana. I love to peel and freeze my bananas, mix them in my super duper Vitamix with some water. Whew, it's so delicious. As long as your bananas are spotty when you freeze them. So I just do that. It's best to freeze them in like a freezer bag. So I just put mine in this bowl and then transfer them to the freezer. So what am I doing? Built a small tiny house, surviving, surviving, happy to be here. So anyway, I just wanted to keep this short and sweet because it's been a long time since I've been with you, but I'm still the same, still a crunchy mom. I still love researching everything that I can about health and lifestyle and getting it all right in the end. I love to talk and hear from different people, different opinions too. So anyway, would you like to see what I purchased for my birthday? Just fruit and vegetables. <laughs> Just my favorite papayas, my favorite bananas avocados. But before I go to inspire you all, I will show you my kitchen table. Okay, so first thing I purchased was these platanos. <laughs> There's so many different ways you can use these. Since I live here in Ecuador, I really love to mash these up with some egg whites and cook them, you know. Um, they make a great banana muffin without the sugar, without the flour. Just mash these. You cook them when they're ripe and spotty, mash them with some egg white and bake them and it's like healthy banana bread. Right here. Okay, some of my favorite things. <laughs> Birthday papaya. Oh, so sweet and juicy and yellow. Perfect for eating right now. Avocados, you can never have too many avocados. I love making an avocado dip with carrots and onions and oh, tomatoes. Lemon juice. <laughs> I'm always buying tomatoes, stocking up on tomatoes, buying them by the crates. I love to make fresh pasta sauce, picante sauce. Ah, so delicious. What else did I purchase? Purchased a couple different kinds of bananas. I like to freeze these. Different bananas have different flavors here in Ecuador. These are plantains. I like to mash them with Stay tuned to find out what I do with my plantains. And what else is here? 
We have lots of carrots and spinach. Can you see the spinach? <laughs> and potatoes and a few eggs. I do do a few eggs and potatoes, um, tiny bit of rice and a tiny bit of fish. I don't like to promote fish because of the state of our oceans, but I tell everybody limit their consumption, but I think a little bit of fish every once in a while is good for the health from the ocean. What else? I have some, did you see papaya or pina? Pineapple, Pineapple. pina and espanol. But I hope you're inspired. Get out there and get your fresh fruit and veggies. I love you all. Stay tuned.